Ninjago has had a lot of different suit designs for the main ninja, even having a major design change in Season 8. In this video, I'm gonna try my hand at creating my own Ninjago designs using my own design philosophies. I've been creating my own designs for different media on my Instagram since 2019, so I decided to put this skill to good use and imagine a more realistic take on Ninjago. So, I grabbed some pieces from my collection to start building. Also, before we get started, I just wanna say these are my own interpretations for the ninja. If you don't think they should look like this, then that's your opinion, so please be civil in the comments. Now, let's get right into the video. Let's start with the fire ninja, Kai. For Kai, I used Dean Thomas's face print, and I think it fits him really well. I tried to make the ninja designs consistent with each other, so they all mostly use the core torso pieces. A pretty solid figure that I'm pretty proud of. He also has his mask, of course. Now here's my favorite ninja, Cole, using a face from the football table set. Like most of the figures in this video, that set is so useful for faces and hair pieces and I just love it, but the actual football tables on my living room floor is just too big, I have nowhere to put it. Anyways, he uses the core torso and some white shoes since I love me some white shoes in any design, I'm gonna be honest. He of course also has his mask. Now here's Zane, a bit different using the Dragon's Rising torso, but the overall style and consistency between the ninja remains the same for him. Using another face from the football table set, he's one of my favorite ninja from this video. And here's how he looks with his mask on. Now let's take a break from the ninja and let me show you Nia. I made these figures mostly based on the pilots and season 1 of the show, so she's in an outfit inspired by her OG appearance. In a more casual look, I think she looks really cool. She's also using a face from the football table set, an overall really cool figure that I'm pretty proud of. Going back to the four main ninja, here is Jay, using his normal Jay hairpiece in Ginger and the core torso. He's probably my favorite figure from this video. I think I perfectly capture his personality in this more realistic style, and I couldn't be happier with how he looks. He, of course, also has his mask. And with that, here's how all of the ninja look together. So cool. And last but not least, here's Sensei Wu, with not that many significant changes since Wu dis- Since Wu's d Okay. <laughs> with not that many significant changes since Wu's design is already pretty perfect. I thought it would be cool to give him some boots as it's a nice change of pace. I really like how he looks and I'm pretty proud of him, even though he's pretty similar to his original design. And that's all of the figures, I hope you liked this more realistic take on the ninja and let me know if you would like to see more videos on this series of me making realistic versions of other Ninjago characters. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and take care.